loved our conversation. MSNBC chief legal correspondent and host of The Beat, um, my friend and colleague Ari Melber is here. Ari, what should we be um, thinking and feeling now just moments away from this verdict being announced? What does it say to you that they came to this after 11 hours of deliberation? That's a great question, Nicole. I think that's the question on the minds of everyone watching this, whether that's concerned citizens, the legal community, journalists. Uh, when you look at this time frame of about 11 hours, what we can tell you is that in a similar to some degree case uh, involving uh, an officer facing accusations of police brutality in Minnesota, Mohammed Noor, um, they went 11 hours and reached a conviction. Uh, when you look at other cases, for example, recently, but in other states, uh, Jason Van Dyke was convicted in Illinois. The jury deliberation ran about seven and a half hours. When you think of other examples where sometimes the jury cannot come to a resolution, what we call a hung jury or what a judge declares is a mistrial, that usually does take longer. And we know we don't have a mistrial here because we have the only piece of information from the court is that a verdict was reached. But by way of comparison, a recent mistrial in an officer's case, Michael Slager, took 22 hours. Um, so we know that when a, a jury meets for this long and they met over the course of a couple days here, uh, but a couple good sessions of several hours amounting to 11, um, that they have apparently resolved to the best of their ability what they think happened, that they've reached a verdict. Um, my observation to that would be fairly straightforward, Nicole. It does not appear that there were, to our knowledge, any curveballs, any great set of complex questions. Um, they would have appeared to have gone through the three charges, all the elements, and reached a verdict. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. You should know that you can follow today's top stories and breaking news and catch up on your favorite MSNBC shows all in one place. Download the NBC News app today.